here back with another video today we are doing another buzzfeed quiz and last time i did one of these guys you really enjoyed it i know it's been a while since i've done one of those and i'm sorry i really wanted to do one again but it's just been a while since i've really thought about it so yeah last last time i did this guys i got tons of support i got like 40 views on that video it was absolutely amazing so i figured let's do another one so today it's gonna be can we guess your age and gender from this eight picture test so i don't think they're gonna be able to get it but who cares if you guys are excited for this buzzfeed quiz and you want to see more buzzfeed quizzes on the channel make sure to hit that like button down below and subscribe for more videos in general let's get right to this i feel like i said something twice anyway <laughs> For each question, pick the option closest to how that pic picture makes you feel. Okay. Refreshed. I feel refreshed from that right there. That I don't know why. That's just the first feeling I felt. This right here, like, kind of sad. I kind of, it's kind of sad, right? I mean, it's like it's like it's gray. Although, no, it just looks like they kind of darken the picture a little bit, huh? I don't know. Let's find out. Let's see. Okay, look at all the answers. That was a lot of answers. There's nine. Okay, this one here. This, let me think. What does it make me feel? Um, excited. Oh, hey, that's actually one in there. Nice. Okay. And then there's adventures, unsure, scared, intrigued, happy, wary, chilled, and prepared. Prepared for that. Okay, that's nice. Um, this makes me, uh, let me see. Let me see. Uh, calm. Is there, like, relaxed? Oh, okay, so relaxed is on there. Yeah, that makes me feel relaxed, bro. I'm like super relaxed, <laughs> bro. <laughs> That's scary. Scary. No, not cozy, depressed at home, conflicted, vulnerable. Okay, vulnerable maybe, because scary, I think maybe both vulnerable. I don't know. I think I, I'm just okay. Um, let's see, let's see. That is like. That makes me feel, um, I don't know, I'm okay, let me look, tired, excited, anxious, loose, and closed, energetic, cool, nostalgic, and panicky, uh, energetic, yeah, okay, this, a city we love, nostalgic, is that there, no, okay, then maybe, um, thoughtful, I don't know, I don't know, guys, okay, Okay, um, let's see, um, bored, is that there? Yeah, yeah, it is there. A, wo an, a woman in her early 20s, that's nice, okay, I'm not a woman in my early 20s, that's sad, okay, we reckon you're a woman and you're in her early 20s, you've probably moved away from home or are planning too soon. You are starting to get the hang of adult life. You may also already have a picture in your head of your dream career. If you're doing really well, are already you're doing really well, or are already on the way towards it. Yep, yeah, not 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 at all. Not at all. <laughs> you did it. You got it wrong, buddy. You, you got it wrong. That was sad. Okay, guys. So I found another one that tells you how old you are. Design a house and we'll tell you how old you are. So choose an exterior. Here we go. Um. I like that one and I like this one. I like this one a little more. No, 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 no. Oh, can I choose other ones? Dang it, I can't. Okay. Oh, no, I can. Okay. Um, I, I just realized what that was. And no, that's kind of stupid looking. <laughs> um, I really like the look of this one. That looks really neat. Okay. Choose a bedroom. Okay, so this is a bedroom. Oh, wow, a bed up on pallets. I've never even thought of that before. Interesting. Uh, a bed in the corner, not my deal. Um, let's go with this one. I like that one. Choose a bathtub. One filled with roses. <laughs> not the one filled with roses, guys. That's like a classic bathtub. And then a black one. That looks really ugly. I like, if, if I were to choose from any of these, I don't know why that one's a, that one's a choice. I'm going to choose that one. Okay, choose a kitchen. Why are these all white? They're all white kitchens. Um, I'd probably go with the this no this one. I like that one. Choose an extra. A pool under your bed. <laughs> a home movie theater. This view. An outdoor living for when guests come over. 
Uh, home movie theater. Not a pool underneath my bed. That's kind of stupid. Choose a pool. Uh, okay, so I do get a pool anyway. Awesome. That's a tiny pool. Uh, that's like a two-story pool. Uh, that is a really neat pool. But it's not very big. I call. I choose that one. Okay, I am 24, guys. Apparently, me, right here, I'm 24. What's up, homies? Okay. That's, that's not right, but, you know, you got in the 10-year range. That's pretty good, you know? Okay. <laughs> okay, guys, let me see if I can find one more. Okay, so I, complete, I picked a completely different one this time. Buy eight items from Kmart, and we'll reveal what, you're, what you should name your first child. Okay, pick a top. Um, that one. <laughs> Ghostbusters, man. Pick something from the beauty section. Um... Uh, that one, I don't know. Pick a gift for your niece. My niece, she would like none of these. She's not really pink. She's not into pink stuff. Uh, but if I were to pick one, it would probably be the unicorn. Gotta say. Okay, pick a phone case. Um, let me see. I like that. That looks like granite. I like it. Pick some pajamas. Pajamas. That one, casual. Even if it doesn't say Bugs Bunny on it, I like casual, okay? I don't like fancy stuff. Pick a candle for your bathroom. Um, relaxation, tranquility while you're on the toilet. <laughs> uh, uh, ch color changing candles, that works too. I'm gonna go with that one. Pick something from the accessories department. Uh, I like watches. I got a watch right here. It's, it's old, but you know, I'd rather have a watch than any other stuff. Finally, pick something for your office. Okay, I need a trash can in my office. You got Lee, Lee, Lillian, Everly, Grayson, or Noah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much for telling me what I should name my kids. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, let's do one more. I think we have time for one more, definitely. How easy are you to manipulate? We'll start with a simple one. Which of these two answers will the fewest people pick? Okay, the fewest people pick. Which one of these two answers will the fewest people pick? Okay. Choose this one. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I got it right. What's up, homies? I got it 60. Because if you think of it this way, don't choose this one. People would go against that and choose it because people are rebels, homies. That's right. Okay. Let's make it a little harder. Do you think people are more likely to pick the happy dogs or the sad dogs? Happy dogs. Duh. Because what? No, we're already happy. Please pick me. Oh, I didn't even think about that. It's like, please pick me. And these ones are like, we're already happy. Okay. Now let's uh, uh, up the degree of difficulty even more. Cats are all sad, but your goal and everyone else's is to pick one that has the lowest percentage of picks. Can you do it? Please choose me. I've never been chosen before. You're my only hope. I need you. <laughs> um, I think the lowest percentage is what I'm going, right? Yeah, okay. So I'm going for the lowest percentage. I'd say that one's the saddest looking right there. Then this one, then this one, then this one. So I'm going to go with this one. Dang it, what? The saddest one was the one that people, the fewest people picked. And then the one that I said was second in line is the one that everybody picked because it's close up and personal. Will you acknowledge how the last poll, poll played out and picked the sad cat with the highest percentage of picks? Okay. Um, the, that one was the highest percentage of picks, so I'm gonna choose that one, right? Yeah. Duh. Was that, was that supposed to be like a trick question somehow? Here are four pretty boring pic pictures. Which one do you think will, most people will pick? Um, this one. People waiting, really? Mine was second to last. <laughs> that's nice, that's nice. Okay, okay, here we go. Pick the cat. That is a cat. Yeah, that is not a cat. That is a dog. Uh, <laughs> Finally, here are the results we've seen so far in one big poll. Which do you think the fewest people are going to choose? Which answer do you think the fewest people are going to choose? Um, the fewest people are going to choose. Oh, I know, I know. Because everybody else has gone through this entire quiz. 
So they're gonna pick something that everybody before picked. They're gonna pick something that everybody before didn't pick because that means that it's gonna be most chosen. But it's gonna be this one. Paint drying, wow, okay. That was completely wrong because that one was down at the bottom. I'm sad, this is a sad day. I was thinking that it was gonna be like, completely you know, like reverse reverse psychology I don't know how did you do I sucked at it bro I sucked it was horrible that's how I did oh my okay you probably can't pass this quiz unless you're a teenager that's what it says and I'm a teenager so uh yeah how would you caption this Spongebob meme um I would go like that like dot 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 what oh what that's the right one just like this. Why would I capitalize every third letter? That's stupid. Okay. What are these guys wearing? Uh, pajamas. Clearly. Um, a romper. What the heck is a romper? Uh, what is a rompim in a one piece? Okay. Um, what are these guys wearing? They're wearing a one piece. A rompim. I have no idea what the heck a rompim is, okay? So I think I messed up. Uh, definitely not Shawn Mendes. J maybe... Charlie Booth, definitely, definitely not. Sam Hunt, maybe Zed. Okay, so either of these two, any mini mighty mo get detected by Zed. Oh, it's Charlie Booth, dang it. Okay, fine, fine. Okay, the American musician Charlie Booth. Oh, that's sad. What does cross faded mean? Um, when you post the same message on two social social media sites, the state of being drunk and high at the same time. When you when you ghost two different people in the same day. Okay, and a music style where multiple songs fade in and out of each other. Um, this one. Dang it! I don't know, guys. I don't know, okay? I don't know. That sucks. Choose the name that doesn't belong to a Beyonce child. Oh my gosh, it's, it's nice. Uh, oh, that doesn't belong to a Beyonce child. Blue Ivy, North Roomy, Sir. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Blue Ivy. Oh, it's North. Okay, that sucks. Why? Is it like, I don't know these things, okay? I don't keep up with these things. Gosh dang it. North is the name of Kim, uh, Kardash Kim Kardashian's daughter. Oh, I see. Yeah, I don't keep up with that. What, what? Oh, what is this girl famous for saying? Cash me outside. That's what. Oh, homies, I know my memes. That's what I know. I know my memes. What, which isn't a kingdom of... Which isn't a kingdom in Game of Thrones? The North, the Reach, the South, the Stormlands. Okay, I have no idea, okay? I have no idea what the heck this is. Okay, it's not the South, because they're all in the North. Yes, I think. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my gosh, okay. Who directed, who directed 2017's Wonder Woman? Oh, John Watts. Dang it, Patty Jenkins. I don't know, I would just pick a random one. What the heck is she doing? Oh, there she's doing the Wonder Woman side. Okay, okay. Where, where can you find this hot dog? I don't know. I think it's not. I think that's a meme and I'm sad. It's not Pokemon Go. Definitely not Facebook. Maybe Snapchat? Oh, it's Snapchat, homies. What's up? I know my, th I know my stuff. What is this? A unicorn frappuccino? Clearly, because those are so popular for a small amount of time. Which music festival was canceled amid controversy this year? Uh, not Coachella, that's not, I don't even think that's a musical, that's a music festival. Uh, SXSW Bonnaroo Fire Festival. Oh, hey, I just guessed it. I guess I, I guessed it right, homies. That's what's up. This baby is famous because they look like, oh, they look like, what, I don't get it. This baby is famous because they look like, dot, dot, dot. Uh, they look like, uh, Harry Potter. <laughs> I don't know. Harry Potter. Yes. No, nope, I give up because Ed Sheeran. Oh, it does look like Ed Sheeran. That's creepy, dude. That's creepy. Which movie isn't getting a sequel this year? Star Wars, Perfect, Perfect, Blade Runner, and Frozen. Okay. I thought I heard something about Frozen getting a sequel. Uh, I know Star Wars is getting a sequel. Well, not a sequel. I mean, well, I guess it's a sequel. Anyway, uh, Pitch Perfect, maybe, Blade Runner. Nobody knows about Blade Runner, I don't think. <laughs> I don't know, I might have just ticked off a bunch of people. Pitch Perfect! Oh, really? Frozen, is it? Okay, that's nice. Uh, that's nice. Is this 2016 or 2017? Because... 
No, it must be 2017 because Star they wouldn't give it away, you know what I'm saying? What is required in a picture for what in the tarnation meme? <laughs> okay, um, I'd say a cowboy hat, right? Was it right? Yeah, it was a cowboy hat. What's up, homies? Six out of 14 right. I didn't get the majority, but who cares? <laughs> I didn't even get half right. Okay, well, anyways, dudes, if you guys did enjoy this episode of BuzzFeed Quiz and you want to see more BuzzFeed quizzes on the channel, make sure to hit that like button down below and subscribe for more videos in general. I'll see you dudes next time. Peace out.